today I'm going to tell about the story of the rainbow flower. One day, a little girl named Jenny bought a string of bread rings in a baker shop. Suddenly, a dog appeared and stole the string of bread rings from her and quickly ran off. Are you naughty dog? Jenny cried and ran after it. She ran and ran but couldn't catch it. Soon, Jenny was lost and had no idea where she was. She walked around for a while and found herself standing in front of a small house. With a lovely little garden, an old woman appeared at the garden gate. The old woman gave Jenny a magical rainbow flower and said, Each of the seven petals on this flower can grant you a wish. Jenny tore off a yellow petal saying, Dear little petal, please take me back home again with the bread rings. No sooner were the words out of her mouth than she was back in her own house holding a string of bread rings. Jenny was astonished and thought to herself, This is really a wonderful flower. I'll put it in the prettiest vase we have. While putting the flower in the vase, Jenny accidentally knocked it over. It fell onto the floor, breaking into tiny pieces. Jenny tore off a red petal. Dear little petal, Please mend the vase. No sooner were the words out of her mouth than the vase put itself back together. Jenny went outside and saw some boys play. They were pretending to be Arctic explorers. Jenny tore off a pink petal saying, Dear little petal, please take me to the North Pole right this minute. No sooner were the words out of her mouth than she found herself all alone at the North Pole. In her little summer dress, it was freezing cold. Just then, a polar bear, polar bear appeared and started coming towards her. She was very frightened. She tore off a green petal and escaped from the North Pole. Now, Jenny was back where the boys were playing. She told them that she had just been to the North Pole, but all they did was laugh at her in disbelief. Jenny went to play with the girls, but none of them were willing to share their toys with her. Jenny was very upset. She tore off an orange petal saying, Dear little petal, please bring me all the toys in the world. Millions of toys appeared. Jenny quickly tore off a violet petal saying, Dear little petal, please send all the toys back to where they came from. In the end, Jenny only had a blue petal left and she didn't know what else she could wish for. Just then, Jenny saw a little boy sitting on a bench by the wall. She asked him if he wanted to play hide and seek with her. The boy said sadly, I'd love to, but I'm disabled and I cannot run. Hearing this, Jenny immediately tore off the last petal, saying, Dear little petal, please, please, make this little boy able to run. No sooner were the words out of her mouth than the boy threw away his crutch 
and sprang up from the bench. Jenny jumped for joy. The pair of them played hide and seek. The boy ran so fast that Jenny could not catch him, no matter how hard she tried. The story tells us that helping others is the key to helping ourselves, because seeing other people's smiling faces will make us happy and grateful. This is the story of the rainbow flower. The end. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.